Ladies and gentlemen, it's nice to be back on set again on the SK show on the SK Reality TV. Today is going to be a very big edition, a bumper edition, because we are going to be dealing with a very, very controversial issue. You know, we need to look at this issue critically and we need to also sell it. That's what it's like, you know, we are here to promote love and peace and promote unity. You know, we have on set a young man, an upcoming artist. A talented singer, a graduate of Akant uh, Education from the great Ambrose Ali University. His real name is Patrick Agui, but you can call him 24 Angelic. That is his stage name. 24 Angelic, how are you doing? Fine, sir. How are you doing? 24 Angelic. How, how do you come by that name? How, I want to know that name sounds you know, very <laughs> spiritual. How do you come by the name? You Angelic. know, music is spiritual, sir. And my stage name came through church when I was in church in Lagos. Mm. So an angelic is someone who is passing message to his people. And the two for angelic is a symbol when your ancestors and your angels want to communicate with you. With you. Mm. And that is the meaning of two for. That was why I just 24 hours. The 24 hours. That was why I included that two for angelic mm. together. It's an angelic, but I'm, all my songs are angelic. I'm passing message mm. to the world. Spiritual songs. So they are spiritual. They're not just ordinary songs. Yeah. So for how long have you been in music? Now, how did you start? I've been in music for decades now. I said that before when I was in interview in ITV. I started singing right from my childhood. Even in my secondary school, I do participate in end of the year party. My principal can bear me witness over that. So this journey I've been long, even when I met Kinsona I day, when Kinsona they came to Epoma to play at uh, Godinombo's former Union Bank manager, at his mother's brother or his father's brother. Then when I met Kinsona they gave me complimentary card to come over to Lagos. So that's how the music started. So you were once a member of Kinsona Day's band? Not a member. I was just a boy. I do call mm. Kinsona Ade my godfather. Yeah. Because actually when I met him on stage, I explained everything to him. He said I should come over to Lagos after mm. my secondary school, my YAC mm. examination. I went to Lagos to see Kinsona Ade. That was when he paid my studio fees. Mm. I went to uh, Little Fish mm. to record my songs. Mm. I've been to Righteous Man before to mm. record some songs. Mm. So that is how my musical career started. Okay. I've met with uh, Two Face, Julezu, mm. Julezu, with so many big La Face studio. I've been there. We are the one that launched WWTTI okay. at Planet One. Okay. I was there with uh, the Two Face, uh, Face, and Jimmy Jack. Mm. Uh, uh, you see, Badrens, you see this young man sitting here. I've heard him sing. You know, he's a great singer, talented singer, very, very good singer. One of the Greatest singer I've ever seen. You called me recently and you were telling me something. And uh, when you said it, I was a kind of uh, I was shocked, surprised. You said the song Calm Down yeah. by Reba, that you are the original owner of that song. Definitely, sir. How do you prove that? How? How? I don't understand. Sir, 2020, mm. when I was in my home, uh, I was not actually social media freak before. So, I was looking for money to become a superstar. Mm. So when I finally got a job where I'm, I'm working now, mm. I'm earning money. So the job took over me. Mm. Then I was not thinking about my music again. Okay. Then there was one day, you remember that little boy that said, Mommy, calm down. That went mm. viral. Mm. That the Lagos State uh, Governor gave him an uh, award, something like that. Mm. Then that little boy vibe was driving me no mm. music is mystery mm. your vibe can hit you in any anywhere then anywhere i was just trying to make something out of that song mommy calm down calm mm. down see your uh, uh matter put in my heart for mm. i was just trying to that that time was during the time of lockdown mm. that was doing it doing it it was one fateful morning or sunday morning or sunday night and when i was sleeping i never knew it was my mom Mm. I, I never grew up to know my mom. Okay. Your mom the, died? My mom anyway. died when I was a little child. Mm. The next thing I heard was, uh, baby, calm down. Calm down. 
Then I walked up. I told my, my wife will bear me witness. If Rema is a good do, it will come up on air. Because I have never seen where two people will have the same inspiration. It will come up on air to tell the world the truth that actually Two for Angelic is the owner of that song. Then I told my wife that they don't give me song again. Actually, sometimes I see music through the dream. Mm. My wife said, has also song, 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 song. Then I told my wife to give me the phone. I was in the bedroom. I started recording that, mm, that song, song so that I would not forget the vibe. Mm. I now told that mommy, calm down. To baby, to baby calm down. Mm. Calm down. See your body, they put in my heart for her. Before it was, mommy, calm down. Calm down. See your body, they put in my heart for her. Then I started vibing on my phone. Mm. Then I vibed the chorus and I also did the, uh, solo. the solo, the verse, so that the guy, after creating the beat, the guy will cut my part mm. inside. I remember vividly that I said, I see one girl from my party, she wear yellow as a bad sharp guy. I walk, uh, I walk up to her. Then I send it to the guy called Liquid. Mm. I remember vividly that Liquid. Who is Liquid? Who is Liquid? Liquid is a producer. Okay. I use four producers. One is in the Port Harcourt in Aouda. One is in Ekboma. A two is in Ekboma. Then, which I was also calling you, you said I should come to produce mm -hmm. then. Then, when I send that voice note, because I'm a busy person, if yeah, we are not in a global world, they can come and investigate. Then, I went, my Oga called me, I, I should come to Port Harcourt. I went to Port Harcourt, definitely. When I was in Port Harcourt, actually, I called you that I'm not in Port Harcourt. My Oga said I should go my train some boys I brought to Port. I had that song. DJ was not playing, baby, calm down. It was as if I was dreaming. Mm. I said, ah, who can sing this song exactly? Like this guy just to get the same vibe like me. Where I caught them, it was when I had the solo, mm. the first one. I see one girl from my party, she wear yellow. I said, no, no, no. That was when I called you, sir. Mm. I called you right from day one. I said, can two people have the same inspiration? I was not that sure again that mm. ah, maybe this guy also got the same vibe like mm. me. During the time of uh, lockdown. lockdown and uh, that little boy that said, uh, mommy, calm down. He was able to do something like what I was trying to bring up. So it's when I, I said, no, you said you can have something similar like that, but not the same vibe. I can very have baby calm down with me. See your uh, uh, your mother, they put in my heart for your love. They put my heart for lockdown. And uh, get your sweet life, Fanta. What is Fanta? And they would ask Rema, how come about that? Uh, lockdown and why he used that word Fanta there. So I was so shocked that Rayman was doing my own kind of vibe. Where I caught them was that I see one girl for my party. She wear yellow. It's okay. Now, where do you think this whole thing is coming from? Because we have never met Rayman. I've never met Rayman. That was so why the thing just looked like uh, it's as if okay. I'm dreaming. Where do you think the, the whole issue is coming it from? It is that guy called Liquid. Because actually, when I called you, uh, that was last year, I mean, last two years, mm -hmm. I saw that guy went to Lagos the same, that exactly that time, 20, 2022, between that time, he was producing Zazu. I believe that was when that guy leaked at my song to. Uh, have, uh, you, have you approached Liquid to find out from Yes, you? I approached Liquid. I told him Liquid, the first time I met Liquid on the street when I was going to my shop. I met Liquid with his wife. His wife would bear me witness. His wife was right there. I told Liquid, that song when I sent for you may produce the beat for me during the time of lockdown. Ah, baby, calm down. Percy don't sing that. Actually, I never knew that it was Rema that sang that song. He said, how? Oh, okay, okay, okay. When I reach us, I go check my phone to know whether it really did. Liquid forgot that he called me. One time that I don't finish the beat to if I travel to or tackle. Okay. Then I was waiting for him to give me a reply. Then liquid, liquid drove off. I never bothered to look. I was thinking that liquid would come to me. He knows my shop to explain things to me. One day I met liquid at the beer parlor. She was driving by. I said, liquid, Alpha, that thing when me tell you, you know the talk put. I've been investigating this matter. The next thing liquid would tell me, told me, you get the voice record again. That do, was, do you really still have the voice? What, that as, was when yeah, as a proof. As a proof. That was when the thing dawned on me. Mm. I said, ah, when I get the voice record, I went back to my phones. I never wanted to come on media to explain this thing uh, to people. Mm. It's as if, you know, 
It's as if I'm blackmailing mm. Rema, mm. or I'm, I want to tarnish his image, repetition yeah. or his, his image. That was why I was keeping it uh, privately. I wanted mm. to see with Rema. Then I now I started open uh, chatting. Anywhere I see Rema fan page, I will send message there that I'm the owner. I'm the original owner. I start sending uh, Selena mm. uh, message also because mm. I, I saw Selena Gomez. That the guy, the guy did the the lady did the remix with. Okay. That uh, I'm the original owner of that song. Mm. When I now met journalists, he told me we are not in a global world. What attempts you know you have made so far to meet with Rema and the me. attempt I've made. I traveled to Lagos about four months ago. I was I was in Lagos. I went to uh, Wazobia FM. I met with one man, one guy called uh, TLS. I explained everything to him. I also met with one guy, Solid. I explained everything to him. He said that, ah, since this thing has happened like this, that I should just calm down. I was telling them I want to go to Marvis Records. I want to see Don Jazzy. Mm. One one should ask Rema questions. Because I cannot just wake up. I'm doing well now. Mm. I cannot just wake up that first sang a song called uh, Yakubo Yakubo. Mm. Why did I not say uh, uh, first? went and steal my song because I have that kind of song to Yakubu, 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 Amma Kedbi, Amma. Because I saw that first did his own version. It was not mine. Mm. So seeing my property, someone is using it. I know what I did on my phone. It was a voice record. It was not written, which I sent to that studio engineer to produce the beat for me, which my little link up. It was like as if the, uh, uh, that song was linked to Drama definitely. Okay. So I believe uh, we are in a global world. The WhatsApp company can help me out. So right. okay, okay. Now, if you meet Rema, what exactly do you want from Rema? What I actually want for Rema, you know, when someone comes on social media like this saying that I'm the owner of this song, people will find it difficult to, to believe, believe them mm. that this one they look for money. I'm You're not looking for looking money. For fame. Uh, it's looking for fame. Mm. I just want Rema to know. Maybe Rema. Maybe paying or paying a, a image, uh, homage to that guy. Mm. That this guy was the one that gave me the song. Mm. I just want Rema to know that Recognize. that guy is not the actual owner of that song. I am the original owner of that uh, Calm Down. It's not money. And to recognize you as well. Yes, as also to know that I'm the actual owner of that song. Yes, you know who is you? Mm. The sportings. They mm. make con country and countries. Yeah. They fight. Mm. If Rema is a responsible person. Mm. He will come on air and mm. tell everybody, ah, what that guy is saying, two for jelly is actual. When I'm not telling him to come and pay me. Fantastic. So you told me about, uh, you were saying something about going to Obama Palace. Uh, yes, yes. Can you talk about that a little? Yes. I uh, said, you know, many people, some rich men have money. Mm. Let me say that song of metamorphosed Rema to the global mm. uh, community. Uh, community. Mm. So, if Rema is a good guy, Somebody can have money, but when you wrong someone, mm. you rob someone, mm. you collect what does not belong to you. Mm. And there's an adage my grandmother always told me that, a sang be do. A do be So I cannot say because of Rema of blood with that song that mm. come and pay me money. Mm. So I just want him to know I'm the actual owner of that song. Because mm. I believe two people, even the uh, the Dre, the Snoop Dogg, even people that have been to music, we know that two people cannot have the same inspiration. Mm. Me and you, we are even twins, cannot come, write the same thing and they, it will look similar. Mm. Where I call them, it was that place. I, I see one girl from my party. I remember. It's all right. It's all right. Um, we've been talking to Two Four Angelic. You heard it all. Um, he's not actually angry with Rema, he's not quarreling with Rema. He says he's the original owner of Baby Calm Down. That is uh, tearing everywhere apart right now. All he wants from Rema is to recognize him. He's not hungry. He's a businessman. He's not looking for money. He just wants to be recognized that he's the true owner of that song. And um, if you are a critical thinker or a logical thinker, you, make, you can get some sense, make some reasonable analogy from what the young man has said. So that's the way it has been on the program today. Um, too for Angelic, once again, I want to appreciate you. Thank you very much. For coming on the program. Thank you, sir. To air your views. I want to appreciate your calmness. Thank you, sir. Um, like he also said, 
that son was given to him in a revelation by his late mother. So this is a matter that we all should sit down and look at. And Rema, wherever you are, we are wishing you the very best in your career. We are wishing you that you go higher and higher. And of course, look out for this young man. And let's resolve these issues amicably, you know. Thank you viewers for watching. We ask you the ICT TV, the SKO show. The number is on your screen. You can call us for whatever comment you want to make, whatever observation that you have. You can talk to us. Thank you. Thank Once again, thank you. Thank you.